Hey what's up guys, this is Ryan Zhu and I'm bringing you news about a very very exciting event. I am so excited about this event, it's going to be the highlight of this month for King of the Hill for sure. I am going to tell you guys about the King of the Hill tournament. That's right guys, the King of the Hill tournament. This is not the regular, you know, Nobleman battles and things like that that we're going to talk about. This is a special one day tournament by itself. That's right, you heard that one day. That's what separates this tournament from all the other ones and that um, it's all going to happen over one day. Alright guys, so let me tell you a little bit about this. So I'm going to do this whole pre uh, video via notepad, my <laughs> pen and paper notepad. So this is the King of the Hill tournament. Okay guys, Koth stands for King of the Hill, you guys should probably know that by now. Tournament. Okay. Um, ah, whatever. King of the Hill tournament. Okay, here it is. So, it's going to happen over one day, which is really, really unique about tournaments uh, compared to other King, uh, compared to other Bloons, Tardies, and Spells tournaments before. But uh, I did this because often tournaments don't finish. So if we do it over one day, it will finish, and we will get a winner, which is really exciting. And this day is is this. 26 October. Alright guys, put that in your calendar if you want to participate in the King of the Hill tournament. It's a Saturday. 26th of October. Okay guys, 26th of October, Saturday. That's a day, the single day for this King of the Hill tournament. Next thing you need to know is that it will take about three hours for guys who, you know, are not very strong. That you, you'll get you'll get to play the first couple of rounds and then if you, you probably lose, but you know, this tournament, I want to mention one thing that's very, very important. It's about participation. I'm really, really, this tournament gives you guys um, who have always wanted to play, play against knights, who have always wanted to play against noblemen, give you guys a chance to play King of the Hill games against other people, whether that be noblemen or whether that be, um, you know, some lesser expense players. There's no battle score requirement at all. It's completely, um, just open field, anyone who can play. Um, I encourage as many people to play and register as you want. Um, okay, so it's, it's going to be three hours for people that approximately are sort of, you know, lower level. And it's going to be six hours, six hours on Saturday, on this one day, for the entire tournament to finish. So that's, so if you're, if you're a good player, be prepared to play the whole day, or sort of be around the computer the whole day. You won't be playing non-stop the whole, ba whole day. We're going to have, you know, people playing, and then there'll be a rest, more play, a rest, semi-finals, you know, quarter-finals, semi-finals, finals, all of that stuff, just like any other tournament, over one day, and, uh, yeah, from the beginning to the final, it should take about six or seven hours. So if you're a good player, please, please, please put the, you know, or anybody, put this in your calendar, tell your parents, let them know that you will be very, very busy on this day and just to you know just to book your day for King of the Hill tournament and even if you're not a good player you can still stay around because there'll be a Skype chat room and everything um, uh, so you can stay around you know see the results cheer on your favorite player things like that it'd be really really exciting okay so three to six hours is how long that'll take um, so okay so a couple of things when does it start so it's one day 26 of, of uh, October to Saturday and this is when the tournament starts okay it's 9 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time so that's for you guys on the uh, west coast of America uh, I know a lot of most blue side defense battles are from America so I'm sort of making the time uh, suitable to American time 9 a.m. Pacific Daily Time which is also 12 p.m. Uh, Eastern Daylight Time. Okay? So 12 p.m. for you guys on the East Coast, 9 a.m. for you guys on the West Coast, and for everybody else in the world, uh, should I put this on the side here? Everyone else in the world, it's going to be 5 p.m. Uh, Greenwich Mean Time, and you just use that to find whatever time that is for you. If you're in Europe, uh, it's going to be in the, it's going to be around this time, maybe 4 p.m., 5 p.m., 6 p.m., 10 p.m. If you're in Australia and New Zealand, it's going to be 3 a.m. for me. <laughs> but that's just you know that's the problem with uh, an international tournament like this. But that's really that's also the benefit of having an international tournament is that you can play players from all over the world, which is really really cool. 
So these are the times you need to remember if you want to participate in this tournament. Alright, I need some more paper. Um, so, more stuff about it. Uh, one is that this tournament will be organized over Skype. So you must be on Skype for this to work. Um, I've thought about this and I want to make it as openly available to everybody as possible. But it's going to be really, really, really hard to coordinate everybody if they're all over the place. If some of them are Skype, some of them are on Chatsy, some of them are on, you know, Archive Forum or whatever, it's going to be really, really hard to organize. So you have to be on Skype and that makes it, that's pretty much the only way the tournament can run smoothly. So if you want to participate in this tournament, uh, you have to join, you have to get Skype and please join the uh, King of the Hill uh, Skype chat room. That's already been existing uh, for a couple of couple of days now probably almost a week and I think we already have like 200 plus people in there which is crazy crazy awesome community it's actually the most active um, Blue Star Defense Battles Skype community in the world right now it's actually surpassed I think the uh, some other Skype uh, Blue Star Defense communities out there um, so join this um, Skype chat room to have a chance to play or to play in the tournament um, so to join the tournament, to join the tournament, um, all you have to do is actually very, very simple. You don't even have to uh, tell me, although I would prefer if you tell me that you, you want to join the tournament. But in reality, the only way to join the tournament is to come there to this chat room on the day. So come here at 9 a.m. Uh, at, at these times and uh, and depending on you know and I will spend like half an hour to organize no matter how many players we have I'll organize that into a tournament so maybe we'll get 30 players maybe we'll get 60 players maybe we'll get 100 players I have really have no idea but however many players we get on that day I'm gonna quickly make a draw which is you know like, like a structure for you guys to play and then you'll play your games and then we'll progress to quarterfinals semifinals and finals so yeah just be really the only to participate is really really simple just be in the skype king of the hill chat room and be willing to play obviously have the whole day free that's really important or at least have at least have three hours uh at this time um on this date and uh yeah so how's it gonna work on the day just really quickly is uh we're gonna have like tons of people tons of people um you know arrive in the Skype chat room at 9 a.m. on Pacific Daylight Time or maybe you know whatever wherever you are in the world and we'll have maybe let's say we have um, I don't know let's say we have like 60 people or whatever right then very quickly um, I'm gonna split these 60 people into groups of four people each so there's gonna be tons of four people groups okay and these four da 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 until we get uh, you know 60 or whatever maybe there'll be some groups of three as well because uh, you know 60 doesn't divide perfectly into four and then uh, the people in the group of four that you're assigned to everybody plays everybody in this group so if we have player one player two player three and player four then maybe one will play four and two will play three first and then one will play three two will play four you know whatever until everybody plays everybody Right, and then once that happens, and this is called a round robin, by the way, for anyone who knows who knows what a round robin is. It's pretty simple. And then from that, we'll be, we'll basically get to know uh, who's the best and the rest from each group. And the best player from each group will go on into the second stage of the tournament, uh, which is called a knockout structure. So then we'll have like tons of players, maybe player one, player two, player three, player four. These are the, all the guys who uh, made it out of the group in first place and they will basically go on to uh, face each other so five will maybe play six seven plays eight whatever until you know however many players we have and they play each other and uh, then you know the winner plays the winners and then whatever and then we have the semi-finals and then we have the final and then we have the champion yeah the champ so I've worked it out, all of this should take about 6 hours in total to get to the champion. Uh, the first stage, which is the groups, which is where most of you will be participating. Because uh, you know, from the structure we can see that one quarter of the people 
or go to the next round. And unfortunately, three quarters, you know, would have had a chance to play three King of the Hill games, which I think is really, really cool. A lot of King of the Hill practice for you guys and experience for you guys. And uh, this will take, you know, approximately, I think, an hour and a half to two hours. But, you know, just come and prepare for three hours just in case, okay? And uh, so last of all, the rules. Uh, so we all should all know King of the Hill rules by now, okay? Uh, the, the whole entire tournament is King of the Hill rules. Uh, no ice stalling. Round 38. Um, you know, most lives wins. Um, you know, whatever other rules that we have in King of the Hill. I think, I think uh, first map is Yin Yang. Uh, loser picks map, all of that. And uh, last thing I forgot to mention is that in these groups of four, uh, it's best of three. So best of three in these groups. Which means that uh, first person to win two games uh, advances. And then uh, once we get to the group stage, all I know is that the final is best of five. Best of five. The semi final is also best of five. And then anything before that is um, just best of three. So I, I don't know how far, you know, depends on how many players we get and stuff like that. But. Best of five for the semi semi-finals and finals, otherwise best of three for the other games. And um, yeah, that's it. Please come and participate. Um, I would really appreciate it if you guys let me know that you're participating. Uh, that way I can get a rough estimate of numbers. Please let me know if you're participating, that'd be really great. And um, yeah, we we'll look forward to uh, you participating in this King of the Hill tournament. 26th of October. Don't forget the date, save the date. And uh, make sure that you have just have, you know, access to the computer. You can have little toilet breaks and little snack breaks. But generally, we want you at the computer, ready to play at a moment's notice. Anytime, basically. Um, you know, don't leave the computer for more than five minutes or more than maybe ten minutes. You can get some food and stuff, but please eat your food at, at the computer. That way, um, you know, basically everybody will be hanging out in the Skype chat room. There'll be lots of people in there, uh, you know. And then... Uh, all the people that want to go to the tournament, we're gonna, I'm going to create a new uh, King of the Hill tournament uh, chat room. Right, so then we have like lots of people in here, um, you know, that are all participating in the tournament. And then I'm going to make the groups of four on, on you know, on, on paper or whatever. And then I'll break you guys into your groups of four. So I'll um, create a new Skype chat group with... Uh, you know with the four people and then you guys sort of can easily communicate with each other in this uh, in this group of four people and basically it's sort of your responsibility to organize yourselves to uh, finish your games uh, play against everyone plays everybody uh, we will have uh, helpers such as myself and some other King of the Hill managers uh, helping you guys get organized if you get stuck and uh, but, but the idea is that you know maybe these two games might finish early and these two guys are still going you know then after you finish early please don't go anywhere please don't just leave for half an hour and then it's hard to get the second game good game going after you finish just stay online stay on skype so that you can get ready to play as soon as the other games are finished um so that's you know me being very very strict about this but the reason i'm doing this is because it's, it's you know it's really really hard to run a tournament uh smoothly and so Having your help doing and doing that is uh, is a really really important and would be really really helpful. So I'm really really looking forward to this tournament. Uh, yep, just let me know if you want to sign up. Um, and uh, yeah, I look forward to seeing you there, 26th of October, 9 a.m. or whatever other time, 9 a.m. Pacific Daily Time, and whatever other time for other people. Um, yep, that's it from me. My name is Ryan Zhu. Take care, guys.